There he is again. Gerry Wiebenga, or as you English-speaking people like to call him, Gary Wiebenga. In a discussion with MC Toon, he tried desperately to avoid addressing the North and the South Pole being real. He proposed this experiment. I, that's why I asked. Do an experiment, McCune. Maybe you can show me completely wrong, but this is what you got to do. Get somebody with a rectilinear lens, point the camera straight up with you, with you, lay on your back and lay with your head pointed due north and your feet south, and then do another one the opposite way, south and north. Take the time lapse picture and tell me what you come up with, McCune. You're not going to see what you think you see. Nobody in his right mind would be lying on the ground at night for any period of time to see what Gary predicts he would see. That with your head in the northern direction it would look like the stars are making a U-shape around the point at your head. And with your head in the southern direction it would look, it would look like the stars are making a U-shape around the point around your feet. He seems to think that with this experiment he has shown that there are, is only one pole, the North Pole. He is talking about U-shaped star trails with a center of rotation outside your circle of view and that that point of rotation always lies north of you, at the North Pole. But when asked if all the pictures of the South Celestial Pole are fake, then he pulls this trick out of his sleeve. He says this. When you do, when you point to the south, you're going to get the edge, of, the far edge of your circle of view, right? Because you have a circle of view, right? You can turn around in a circle. It's going to be the same distance each direction, right? So you, from your latitude, if I point south, I can get a star trail that looks like it's got a center point right there at my horizon, right? So one time he says there is only one pole, the North Pole, that is always north of you and the next time he says that when you look south you'll see the center of rotation of the stars right there on the horizon. When are these flat earthers ever get their story straight?